for action. For the past 18 months, thousands of soldiers have been deployed to the northeast. But the fight against Boko Haram has been a disaster. The jihadists have increased in strength and captured territory, often sending troops fleeing. I met some soldiers who were dismissed from the army last week after serving on the battlefront. They were accused of disobeying orders to fight, but they say they were ill-equipped, outgunned, and at times their armoured vehicles even ran out of fuel. We may have insufficient fuel inside. Then when the fuel finished, then the next thing you do is just to abandon it. And then what happened to the vehicles? The Boko Haram take hold of it. I feel insulted. I feel embarrassed. I feel humiliated. In their latest attack, Boko Haram fighters crossed the border into Cameroon, where they abducted men, women and children. Some have been rescued by the Cameroonian military, but dozens were taken into Nigeria, where the jihadist group is trying to establish an Islamic state. As the crisis in Nigeria deepens, some serious problems within the military have been exposed.